It seems that Todd Chrisley will be spending Thanksgiving in jail. It has been stated that the former star of Chrisley Knows Best is very upset that he would not be able to spend the upcoming holiday with his loved ones. The 54-year-old former reality TV star's lawyer, Jay Sergeant, stated to TMZ on Tuesday, November 21, that his client is very upset about his situation as his first holiday season behind bars begins and he's around other inmates instead of loved ones. Jay continued by revealing that Savannah Chrisley, the daughter of Todd and his wife, Julie Chrisley, is planning to visit both Todd and Julie in prison at some point over the holidays. Jay had talked to RadarOnline.com the day before on Todd's stay in jail for the holiday. Todd feels bad he can't be home for the holidays with his family, Jay told the site. That being said, the lawyer gave his word, we are working on it. It was disclosed by Jay during the conversation that Todd Angeli's appeal case is moving forward. As per the lawyer, the kids have been given some hope that their parents may be able to get out of jail before the original dates. Jay went on to say, Todd is content. He's happy with the direction things are taking. We're overjoyed. It's encouraging. He further revealed that the 26-year-old daughter of Todd and Julie feels very satisfied with the good news. Julie's prison sentence is shortened by one year, while Todd's is shortened by two years. As per the legal paperwork that the outlet managed to get, the married pair is scheduled to appear at their hearing in Atlanta on March 25, 2024. Prior to receiving a 12-year jail sentence, Todd was found guilty of conspiring to commit bank fraud, bank fraud, conspiracy to defraud the United States, and tax fraud. Julie, meanwhile, was given a seven-year prison sentence after being found guilty of conspiring to commit bank fraud, bank fraud, conspiracy to defraud the United States, tax fraud, and wire fraud. Todd and Julie started serving their prison terms in January at two different establishments. She stayed at FMC Lexington in Kentucky, while he went to FPC Pensacola in Florida. They will be at their respective facilities for the upcoming holidays.